Hello, RPG Don here. Today, we are going to discuss how to use a self-switch to end an event. The event I'm going to end is text set by an auto-run event. First, I'm going to make my two maps. My first map, then I'll right-click on the bar to the left, New, and make a second map. I'll right-click on that map and generate a simple dungeon. I'll set my transfer point by right-clicking, quick event creation, and making a door. I'll right-click and edit, then right-click the transfer point, edit that, click the drop bar, and lead it to my second map. Apply and OK. I'll also make a door that leads to this map on the other map. So I will click the other map, right-click at the event spot, quick event creation, door, click the drop box, and have it lead back to this map. Now that our paths are set, I'm going to make the auto run event happen. I'll double click anywhere, click the first black diamond, tap 1, show text, and type in my desired text. I'll click OK, and set the trigger to auto run. So that this text will only happen the first time I'm on this map, I will make a self switch. To make the self switch, I will double click the black diamond under my event. Game progression, control self switch, self switch A, and operation on. Click OK, and now up here on the top, a new event page. On this new event page, tab 2, under conditions, I will click self switch, and make sure it's on self switch A. Now I will apply and OK. We will test our game now, and make sure we save it before starting. When we enter the map, our auto run event will happen, and then disappear. Going to a different map, and then returning, will not reactivate the event. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to show your support. If you have any ideas of what I should make a tutorial about, please leave a comment about it. See you on the next video.